If you want to start using the paid version of card, you should click on the link in the description to get the best discount available. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make a button go to another page in card. As you can see here, I already have a created content. Now on the left side, on my content, you'll see here the next button. On the left side, you'll see here the editor for the button and you will see here the URL. Here are the allowed URL types in card. Now to add a section break, just select the hash the control and then change the name to your preferred name. But in this case, I'm going to name it page one and then click the plus button again and select the container. Now, put an element in there or anything you want to put in it. Now, the purpose of section breaker or section break is the divider or the breaker of the content. And in order to link it to the another page, you'll need to copy the name of your section break. So in this case, I'm going to type the hashtag page one since it's my name of my section break. But in order to make this button responsive, you'll need to avail the paid plan in card like this. So when you click the next button, you will see here the on click. You will see here it was locked because you need to avail the Pro plan. So, assuming you already avail the plan, you can now access the on click function for your button. And that's it. That's how to make a button go to another page in card. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the YouTube channel.